Last night, I ran into the same frustrating issue, the Val 43 error. I was stuck, couldn't connect, and had no clue what to do. But after a bit of troubleshooting, I found the solution. I managed to fix it. So I thought, why not share the solution with you in this step-by-step -step guide? Even though I got a few comments from you guys, let's do it step-by-step. -step. Just do me a favor, follow all the steps as I do with proper alignment without skipping anything, and by the end, your problem will be fixed. Bet. Now, you might be wondering, what is the VAL43 error? In simple terms, it's a system timeout. This means your computer couldn't connect to the Valorant servers within the expected time, causing the Riot client to fail. Usually, restarting the Riot client solves this issue, but if it doesn't, try these methods that can help. Method 1. Renew IP addresses and DNS. For this, we'll use command prompt to refresh your internet settings. Here's how. Press the Windows key, type CMD, and right-click on command prompt to select Run as administrator. Once the command prompt opens, type the following commands one at a time, pressing Enter after each ipconfig slash release. This will disconnect your internet. Now type the second command, ipconfig slash renew. This reconnects you to your network. Then type ipconfig slash flush ADNs. This clears outdated DNS records that might be causing issues. Now restart your router or DSL modem. After restarting, wait for your internet to reconnect. Then finally type ipconfig slash register DNs to update your DNS settings from your ISP. That's it. At this point, try launching Valorant again. If the error persists, let's move on to the next step. If this doesn't work, then try the second method. These methods align as we are resetting everything step by step because we don't know which part of Valorant is causing the connectivity problem. So yeah, follow step by step. Method two, clear Valorant settings. Sometimes corrupted client files can be the culprit. Press Windows plus R to open the run dialog box. Type app data and hit enter. Now go into the local folder, look for Riot Games, then Riot Client, and then Config. Find the Riot Client settings, which is a YAML source file. Select it and press Shift plus Delete or right click and delete this file, then clear your recycle bin. Once done, restart your PC. After restarting, go into the C drive again, open the Windows folder. At the bottom, find two files, vgkbootstatus.dat and the second one, 39266 Just select both or one by one and delete them. Once done, relaunch the Riot client and try to log in. Now at this moment, your problem should be resolved. But if not, there's another step. Method three, use Cloudflare. Warp. Download the Cloudflare Warpy tool for your Windows. I've already downloaded it, by the way. The link will be provided in the description. Just go ahead and download it for your OS. After downloading, install it and launch the app. Click on the tray icon, look for Cloudflare Warp, and connect it to 1.1.1.1 with Warp. After this, relaunch the game and this will hopefully resolve your problem as it did mine. That's it. Simple and effective methods. These methods will resolve the issue 100%. Don't forget to subscribe this YouTube channel for my tech fixes. See you.